Tempe Wells Fargo employee died at her desk. And 12 News is now confirming that it may have taken as many as four days for anyone in the office to notice. Gabby, four days. I mean, this poor woman went four days undiscovered. It's hard to believe. And that's a question many employees are asking themselves tonight. I spoke with an employee who said that she shared her perspective on the workplace environment, and they say it's a big building, but most people don't work there on a daily basis. A Wells Fargo employee went to work the morning of Friday, August 16th, and never went home. Tempe police tell 12 News 60-year-old Denise Prudhomme scanned into work at 7 o'clock in the morning. Four days later, police responded to the office building near Washington Street and Priest Drive for reports of a subject down. Prudhomme was declared dead. The Tempe Police Criminal Investigation Bureau is investigating, but do not suspect foul play. A Wells Fargo employee exclusively spoke with 12 News, but asked not to be recorded or identified out of fear for their job. They say a colleague found Prudhomme dead at her desk in a cubicle while walking around the building on Tuesday, August 20th. Prudhomme's cubicle was reportedly on the third floor and away from the main aisle. This employee says several people had smelled a foul odor but passed it off as faulty plumbing. They say while most Wells Fargo employees at this Tempe location work remote, the building has 24-7 security and someone should have found Prudhomme.